There are approximately 800 different species of eel found all around the world. They can be found in freshwater or saltwater and are capable of living in hot or cold climates depending on the species. What many people don't know is that there's one species of eel that lives on land in southern Texas that's very different from all the others. I'm Patrick of Coaster Fanatics and today I'm bringing you my POV and review of Steel Eel. This coaster opened in 1999 at SeaWorld San Antonio and is a custom sit-down coaster built by Morgan Manufacturing. Steel Eel has a max height of 150 feet with a drop of 150 feet and a top speed of 65 miles per hour. It has a total track length of 3,700 feet for a total ride time of 1 minute and 40 seconds. Steel Eel gets a lot of negative reviews, but I actually really liked it. In fact, I'm a big fan of all the Morgan coasters I've been on so far. They're all pretty underrated if you ask me. You start off by slowly cresting over the lift hill which provides excellent views of the surrounding area. Although technically Steel Eel isn't a hyper coaster, the drop definitely feels like you're on one. At the bottom you pass really close to the water and get a nice view of Wavebreaker the Rescue Coaster as you pass by. From there you hit two very large airtime hills. They aren't the best in the world but you do get some decent airtime on them. Next you hit the mid-course brake run followed by a bank turnaround that gets very close to the ground. Overall, this is the most intense part of the ride. After that, the fun really begins with the Camelback Hills. This is overall the best part of the ride as it provides excellent ejector airtime similar to Mamba or Steel Force. The ride then ends with an S-curve back into the station. Like I said, I really enjoyed Steel Eel. I mean, is it top 20? No, but it's still a solid ride overall and is arguably the best coaster at the park, at least in my opinion. Very smooth and comfortable ride as well. Like I said, I'm a big fan of the Morgan coasters. Steel Eel ranks in my top three I've been on so far and I most definitely recommend giving it a try. Okay, pull those lap bars down tight, get your hands in the air and enjoy your ride on Steel Eel. Welcome back riders, I hope you all enjoyed your ride on Steel Eel. If you did, don't forget to like and share this video with your friends. Also let me know what you think of Steel Eel in the comments. Those of you that are new around here can smash that Coaster Fanatics icon to subscribe and stay updated on all things roller coaster. Stay tuned, I have more videos coming from SeaWorld San Antonio that you don't want to miss. 
Thanks for watching and have a good one. I'll catch you all on the next video very, very soon. Thank you.